Hi, my name is June and in this video, I'm going to give you a brief tutorial on how to create your own online store from scratch with the Shopify free 14 day trial. Okay, so on the front page of Shopify.com, you can see here they said that you can try Shopify free for 14 days with no credit card required which means that you don't have to worry about extra fees or costs if you don't want to sign up after the period of time or your card information security and stuff okay so now I will enter my email here click on the start free trial button and see how it goes okay now here is your password setup and your store name well I stepped my store name pastry cookie because I'm craving right now for pastry so let's create my store okay Okay, before they direct you to the admin panel of the website you have to answer some of those questions about yourself it's not like a big deal it's just some easy questions like your purposes of uh, using the trial and I was just to just playing around your current revenue zero maybe food and drink yeah and next some of your basic information and now they're going to direct you to the admin panel okay as you can see here in the, the main part of the page is some of the information for you to know uh, general information some of the COVID-19 update and for the left part is the, the left bar here is the menu bar where, and I will run through quickly because it's just a quick tutorial here are some of the uh, category like your orders here is the board where you can manage your order products this is very important part and I will uh, talk about it later in more details okay uh, customer and you can manage your customer information and yeah there are um, purchase histories and stuff here are some of the analytics uh, metrics some of the index that you can see for your business to uh, help you with your marketing plan plan in the future and some of the marketing automations tool the apps is where, where you can add plus when you want to expand e-commerce solutions but remember that it might be very costly because most of the apps are going to charge you monthly. So if you want to add up your extra cost, please consider when using the apps. Okay? And the settings part here is where you want to set up everything related to your website. Blog posts is where you can write articles, create content so that you can engage with customers more. Uh, pages, you can add pages uh, when you select a plan, but you need to pay for it. Navigation, you want to set up your navigation bar, you want to add some of the categories, blogs. Uh, newsletters and stuff and domain this is your domain name with Shopify when you uh, you can buy your own domain but it can be very costly and depends on your budget 
you want to have. Okay, so let's move to the products first. The important part of starting your online business is to sell your products, right? So here is where you will add your products on your website. Okay, so my website now is pastry cookie. My products is uh, pastry. So I'm, a, I'm gonna add some of the uh, pastry products for my website. You can write the title of the product. Some on. Okay. And this is the description of the product. Make it short and you know attractive to your customer. This is like crispy. And for the media here is where you can add your image of your product. And you have to click to this box so that it, it will be added on your website. Add it on your website. And you can set the price here, let's just for And do you want to charge tax on this product? Inventory is where uh, you will let the customers know if your product is in stock and how many uh, of your products are still in stock. Uh, let's just say 30 here. And shipping. And there's a part that I really like about this product. Um, category is that they will show you how your product name will show on on Google or search agent when customer or visitor they want to find your products. So if you want to know how your products will be displayed on your website, you click here in the uh, this eye icon and you will see how it will show up on the website. See? This has all the price, the description, the picture. And okay, now move to your online store. Here's where you can customize your online store with by changing their themes and stuff. Because Shopify can offer you free tea and you can choose by clicking here and now you can see the theme name is debut okay you can rename and if you want to customize the theme like the text images and stuff can click on customize. You see the website name pastry cookie here. Okay, now there are so many uh, things for you to do with this theme. You should add more images for the slice banner, some images of your products, for your blocks, etc. Try here with the big images. There is my favorite part here is the header. Okay. And you have uh, the part that you can announce some things here. Uh, whenever you have a big discount or free shipping and that you want to inform your visitor. Okay, it will be like this. Uh, feature collections. 
best selling products or products of the day, HP of the day. And I'll collect the selection, home page, select. Okay, let's see how the website would look like. Okay, pastry of the day goes on. Yeah, and you can complete design your website by adding more images, um, products, and stuff. One other thing I love about Shopify is that you can check your mobile version as well because nowadays more and more people are now using mobile devices to buy products. So you have to pay attention to the mobile version as well if you want to miss any of your customers, your potential customers. So here is what your website will look like. Clear. So if you want to see your website clear, you can click the eye icon on the online store and it will look like this. It's a good thing when they give you a 14 day trial for free because you will have time to play around with it and uh, to learn more about Shopify and how to create your website to use it. So this is my short and quick tutorial for you to help you understand more on how to create your website to create your online store for uh, business and I hope that this can help you a little bit okay. and thank you and see you next time bye bye